What's going on fellow Maplers? What you're looking at right now is the advanced analytics for my YouTube channel. Up until this point, I have exclusively made MapleStory content, and I figured before I switch gears into anything else, it would be really cool to share with you all some information that isn't really available to the average player. With that said, I wanted to start out by saying I am truly blown away by the amount of support and viewership I've received on this channel. This is just my hobby. I make videos for fun, to entertain you, and because it fills that creative outlet that I just don't get elsewhere. So it is mind blowing to me that I had over 200,000 views and nearly two years worth of watch time. I'm not a very serious person, but honestly, from the bottom of my heart, thank you for being one of those people. Let's dive into the metrics. So I played around with this a little bit beforehand, but I think if I select secondary metric, more, and unique viewers looks like i need to change it to 90 days i've had about 45,000 unique viewers which presumably means 45,000 actively engaged players with maple story in some capacity and you have to imagine that only a fraction of players watch any content for maple story and specifically my content at that so i would imagine that there are many more people probably to the tunes of hundreds of thousands that have engaged with the game across a few months I feel like that's actually pretty good. I think if I go to geography, I can't utilize the unique viewer metric anymore. So I'm going to revert back to 365 days so we can see the full scope. If I scroll down, it looks like over half my viewers are from North America, which isn't very surprising because I play NA Reboot, but this is crazy. Look at all the places that have people who play MapleStory. It branches out all over the world. I mean, this is, this is so cool to look at. Also, shout out to my 10 viewers from Switzerland. I visited there earlier this year. It was a beautiful country. Learned to snowboard in the Alps, which was an experience to say the least. On to viewer age, and I don't think this is surprising to anybody, but most of the players are in their late 20s, early 30s, which I'm guessing are people like me that revisited the game because they played when they were younger. But that aside, I was absolutely dying before I made this video. I just can't get over the idea that there are some grandmas and grandpas out there watching my Degenerate Maple Story content, and they're one of my longer retention groups at that, which is just hysterical. I absolutely love you, whoever you are. But yeah, it's also good to see that younger people are getting into the game about 20% from 18 to 24. as a good sign that other audiences that enjoy grindy MMOs are trying out the game as well. And there's a spattering of other groups here who might fall into either one of those categories. And yeah, the last tab I went to look at was viewer gender, and this is kind of crazy. There's about a 1 to 24 ratio of women to men, which makes you wonder, why so many henny -os? But who knows how accurate any of this is. It's just some data that I have access to as a content creator. If you have any other things you want me to take a look at, just let me know. And that's about it. Until next time.